All right, hello YouTube, this is Ahoy. So, this week's tutorial I will show you what MP3 distortion does to your music. All right, as we know, uh, piracy is a bad thing. And here I have an example. This is the a short clip of the Gundam style cover that I did. So, let's check it out. Okay, I think it's a, that's enough. Anyway, uh, what I'll do is that I will amplify the track so that we have 6 dB of headroom. Okay, and I'm here just to demonstrate what will happen when I convert the file to MP3. So, as we can see, I have headroom of 6 dB. And what we will start with is that we will export it as MP3 so that, you, you know, we would send it to band and then they give their opinions and whatever. Then when it's done, what happens is that the band gives the file to their video guy who makes a lyric video and then we import the file okay so as we see here is the first pass we have lost about 0 0.4 dbs of headroom already so not that much yet anyway then the band sends the mp3 to the video guy then he exports the video and the video quality is say 128 mp3 for YouTube all right and so then we import the file. Okay, so now the video has been then uploaded to YouTube. And I'm not sure what uh, codec nowadays YouTube is using, but at least at some point they were using 128, so let's use that. So file, export, 128. Okay, so now we are at the situation where the song has been recorded, exported, then put us in 320mp3 for the band, then the video guy exported it so that the video has 256mp3 as the audio, then they upload to YouTube, which on the low quality mode has 128 kilobytes per second on the audio, and then some asshole decides to rip the audio. Alright, so here we have the 128 kilobytes audio. And then they decide to upload to SoundCloud, for example. And SoundCloud uses uh, the same codec. So, file, export, 128, second pass. All right, and then what happens is that some asshole finds the file from that SoundCloud and they decide <coughs> that they will also, exp you know, upload to YouTube so that it gets another pass. And this is actually not as uncommon as you think. And then, if somebody still uses MySpace, please go kill yourself. But okay, they decide to upload to MySpace, and they used 96k, at least when I was using it. 
and OK. All right, so let's see what happened. Let's import the files. 96k to wave. And we amplify this so that we have a new peak amplitude of 6. Okay, so this is what happened on the wave. We lost three and a half dBs of headroom and um, let's see what happened to the plot so here's the plot spectrum we see that it actually take a screen a screenshot so it's easier to compare So this is what happened to the audio. So we lost all the high end. And let's take also a screenshot of this. Like that. So here they are. So we can see that the MP3. Also see that the graph changed. This is the wave. And the peak is at minus 18. And here the peak is about the also at minus 18, but it's a bit different. So we can see that the MP3 basically rapes your audio. So should we also listen how it sounds? Let's do that. Let's start with the wave and then I'll press solo to switch to the MP3. So if you are wondering why, why you know some audio sounds like that on YouTube or whatever place you listen to shitty music from, that's why it's been passed around and around and around and always as a lossy format. Oh yeah, and what I forgot to mention was that you remember the 6 dB that we removed from the headroom? Well, normally that doesn't happen. So you go here, so the file is like this, and then we add the difference, what was it, 3.2 dBs. So this is what actually happens to the sound, because people usually don't normalize so that there is actually headroom when they upload stuff to, you know, places. So. Let's listen. So I'm not sure if it came through very well, but it's distorting like, like hell here. So please support your local music and buy the music and you know, the stuff like that. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do so. And leave some comments below. Thank you for watching and make good music.